The UIL state season continues this afternoon up in Austin with a Class 5A state swimming and diving championships. KSAT 12's Andrew Seeley made the trip up to the swim center and he has more. All eyes were on Alamo Heights senior Connor Foote swimming his last high school meet this afternoon at the Lee and Joe Jamil Swim Center in Austin. His first individual event was the 100 yard butterfly and Foote was the top seed coming in after setting a state record yesterday. All he does today is lower that mark once again, taking down last year's state champ in the process. His final time, 46.09 seconds. Later in the meet, foot struck again, this time in the 100-yard backstroke, capturing his second straight state title in the event. But his most impressive swim might have been the leadoff leg on the 200-yard freestyle relay. Foot set another state record in the 50-yard freestyle, blasting out in a 19.88. He's the only one under 20 seconds at the meet. Add in a third place finish in the 200 yard medley relay alongside Mitchell Patterson, Cameron Chan and Derek Montoya and Foote's final tally is two golds, a bronze and a pair of records. Always been trying to go 19 for the past year. It's been my goal this whole season to finally hit it. It's really, really exciting. I mean, I've had a great high school career. I came out here wanting to set some records, put my name in there and leave it there for a couple of years. It sets me up pretty well. I mean, I'm going to go to a and next year, have some great teammates there, and I'm really excited. The Mules 200-yard freestyle relay that Foot led off eventually faded to fourth, but the Bernie Champion boys finished second overall in the event. Gabe Hawkins, Griff Orloff, Bexon Harrison, and Alexi Mason combined to finish in one minute, 25.58 seconds. Hawkins had two other individual events to swim. He posted a 10th place finish in the 100-yard breaststroke in 58.45 seconds. Orloff took 13th in the same event. And Hawkins also posted a 12th place finish in the 50 yard freestyle. Harrison competed in the 100 yard butterfly. He finished 12th overall in the Constellation Heat. Alamo Heights' Cameron Chan took 14th in the same event up there in lane 8. And in one meter diving, Alamo Heights' Chase Marafiato was in contention for a podium spot. He scored 514.75 points to finish 4th overall. Champions Colin Brewer took 8th with 406.05 points and his Charger teammate Emma Haynes took 9th in the girls 1 meter diving competition. Speaking of the girls, on the girls' side, Bernie Champion continued their streak of relay success at state. The Chargers team of Paige Clark, Reagan Garcia, Emma Seward, and Peyton Bremer put up a valiant defense of their title in the 200-yard freestyle relay, finishing second overall in 1 minute 38.08 seconds. But in the final girls' event, the 400-yard freestyle relay, the Chargers strike gold. This time it was Clark, Garcia, and Kate Deacon handed it off to Bremer for the anchor leg. She splits a 51.03 as the Chargers come from behind to win it in three minutes, 32.19 seconds. For two straight years, Champion is coming home with a relay title. This year we just had a really big drive because they're leaving, they're the seniors, so we just wanted to end the year off really nice for them and just put all of our hard work into it, and it was really rewarding. It's pretty surreal. I mean, it makes us feel like all the work is paying off, all the cold practices at our, at our pool, <laughs> it's just really nice. That was just a slice of Bremer's day. She would finish sixth in the 50-yard freestyle in 23.87 seconds and add a seventh place finish in the 100-yard freestyle. Great Hearts' Valeria Ivanov Gomez took 11th in the constellation heat of the 50. Gomez's teammate Maddie Mealy finished 16th in the 100-yard butterfly. But let's pace ourselves now with the girls' 500-yard freestyle. Como Piper freshman Grace Pertel scored the Warriors' first points at state. She moves up from 16th to 15th with a time of 5 minutes, 19.09 seconds. And how about Wimberley sophomore Coco Proctor? She finished 10th in the 100-yard backstroke in 58.71 seconds. And last but certainly not least, Alamo Heights senior Elizabeth Walsh ended her high school career with a pair of A finals. She took fifth in the 200-yard individual medley in two minutes, 6.12 seconds, just ahead of Champions Deacon, who took sixth in 208.19. Walsh also finished eighth in the 100-yard breaststroke. Congratulations to all of the area athletes who competed in the 5A State Swimming and Diving Championships here in Austin. We will have a full recap of the 6A Swim Meet coming up later tonight on the BGC page at ksat.com. Swing by there and check out all the highlights from this year's action.